the Singers Expo. We are so excited. I'm out here with my homegirl, Tracy. She's so awesome and dynamic and just such a dynamic uh, music professional out of the DMV, but doing things literally around the world. I'm Jonathan Ball of Destiny Road. And today we're so excited to share yes. with some great professionals, so industry professionals yes. that are talking about everything from entertainment law to perfecting your craft to touring around the world if you want to do that as a musician and artist. This is the event, to, this is the place to be. This is the place yes. to be. We also talked about songwriting, preparing for a yes. performance, preparing for recording. Recording, um, studio what, life. Yes, how to make your show better, how to engage with your audience. So this was a great event to educate, connect, and support DMV area singers. Yes, you, you, I guarantee you will not regret it. if you come out to the next one. You missed this one, it's already, it's almost over. It's going on right here in this yes, building, right behind right us. Now. But we're in Columbia, Maryland. If you're in the DMV, Columbia is like the place. I mean, you ha this is an easy place to get to. Yes. And we're doing this just for you. You know there's things that you want to do to add to your skill, add to your gifts as a singer. Don't miss the next one. We're gonna give you information about when the next one will be. But please, you can follow both of us. Um, you follow me at all things Destiny Road Music, destinyroadmusic.com, and on social media at Destiny Road Music. And my name is Jonathan Ball. And my name is Tracy Hamlin. My website is tracyhamlin.com. I'm Tracy Hamlin on Facebook, Twitter, Instagram. Hope to hear from you guys. But for our next event, there's so much great information for you to learn. You're never too great to keep learning and growing. That's it. Don't miss the next Singers Expo. Be there. We're gone. Let's go. Is that good? So again, copyright attaches as soon as your song is more than an idea in your head. If I'm writing the lyrics down, it's copyrighted. It automatically attaches. Why do I need to register the songs? Registering your songs does something really important. It puts the world on notice that this is yours. So if anyone takes it, they had notice. They could have looked it up. They had noticed that that song belonged to you. Well, the way I've copywritten most of my songs is like, just because I was just trying to get a register, it's like in the collection. Okay. What are the pros and cons of that? If, if you want to know how I can break it out, or what do I need to break it out? Say I'm working on an album, and I wrote some of all the songs, but I had other people help me on different tracks. Because I'm the common denominator, I can put those songs in the collection. So there's specific rules of when you can and cannot do that. You can do it all electronically. You can upload your lyrics. Probably you should upload it with the melody and then list all contributors and how much progress you've made so far with that particular song. Be vocal and say that's not it. Those aren't the chords. I hear something totally different. He might have said, what if he's saying that and was like, I really hear this like on a Calvin Harris, like pop, in roll, up vibe. And it's like, he may be like, I don't know. You know what I'm saying? You know? Now, for those who create music, how many music creators do I have? Like, you actually produce music yourself. This workshop slash seminar, whatever Jonathan is calling it, is fantastic. I have learned so much. I've been a songwriter for more than five, six years, but I don't really know what to do with all of the music that I'm getting. Now I know exactly what to do with all of the music that I'm getting. And at one point I had somebody kind of handling a lot of the business part for me, but after being here, I'm, I feel more confident now that I'll be able to handle some of that business part myself. So along with being an artist, I'm also developing as a business person in my business. And what I love, it was so exciting, networking, meeting people, um, having the amazing Tracy Hamlin here, having Jenny Wolf here. You know, we created a song right here on the spot. The whole thing was amazing. I'm begging Jonathan to please do this more often. Do not make this a once a year thing. We need to be in here and you need to be here. What's up everybody? This is Tony Bide Yeso live and direct at the Singers Expo by Destiny Road. I'm telling you, I learned some serious, serious info. Music business, music vocals, how to really, you know, keep this vocal warm and nice and tight for your performance. So much info. So please, oh, the next one, make sure you sign up. Destiny Road. Just go to their website, sign up so that you can get more, more, more info about more events that they have.
total, total packages. They have loads of things that they do. If you're in music or if you're singing, if you're a performer, artist, anything, just go there, find out more details. I had a good time. I learned a lot. I networked and got some good feedback and some of the stuff I'm working on. So let me day signing out. And please don't forget, follow me to all your my TV. So shall we? Thank you. 